Hello, my name is Benjamin Hart. I'm an American attorney and the managing director of Integrity Legal here in Bangkok, Thailand. As the title of this video suggests, we're discussing lockdowns or perhaps not lockdowns, as has been made clear in other videos on this channel. The government has made it explicitly noted that this is not a lockdown, that certain areas of Thailand are under highly controlled the various levels of control measures for this, you know, for this quarantine, whatever you want to call it. And so for that reason, you know, in a, in a legal sense, it may not be best to call this a lockdown. But for practical purposes, there have been as many restrictions as various phases of the lockdown last summer. A recent article from the Bangkok, or excuse me, from Potty and Mail, uh, and that's pottyandmail.com. The article is titled, and Potty and Mail has a lot of, uh, you know, a lot of the potty of press. I, I find a lot of the news, especially on immigration, that we we sort of comb through to figure out what's going on. There, there's a lot of good stuff out of the, a lot of the potty of press organs down there. This, again, this is from pottyandmail.com, and the article is titled, Business Leaders Prep All-Out Marketing Plan for Potty is Reopening. Quoting directly, he expects, and he is Ekasit Nang Pichet, president of the Potty of Business and Tourism Association. So, quoting directly, he expects that res restrictions will be lifted soon, as Chonbury has reported only a handful of coronavirus cases this week, with no confirmed cases on several days. Rayong on Friday also reported no new cases, indicating that coronavirus outbreaks tied to illegal casinos and a Sri Racha beer garden are over. So, the it appears that it looks like things may be trending toward going, I, I hate to use the term normal, but going back to what they were, let's say, at the beginning of the year, right before, right before 2021 ticked over, before we had all this new restrictions imposed. It looks like things may be trending that way again for Padia. We definitely hope to see that, as I'm well aware from many folks that watch this channel and folks that are clients of the firm have told us that things down there got, got pretty darn dire, and, and they had already been in a really tenuous state, especially for small business owners. Totally understand those folks are really having a tough time right now, so I hope for their sake and, and everyone's sake that this you know, situation has abated and we will soon see a lot of these restrictions being lifted. Now that's stated, it remains to be seen exactly what happens with this, but we will try to keep you updated as best we can on this situation as it progresses and evolves.